uh, an antifreeze grip, an antifreeze, an antifreeze. Oh my God! An antifreeze, freeze. Okay, an anti, anti, <laughs> an anti freeze. Yeah. use a blue shampoo, a blue hair conditioner, Olaplex with a cap, hair mask, a protective styling cream, a heat thermal styling spray, an anti-frizz cream, and an oil serum. Okay, I didn't name, I'm not naming my products that I'm using because really it's all the same. I know, I know, don't get me wrong, if I was paid for this, believe you me, I'd be propagating this from left, right and center. But because these are big names and really it's whatever works for you. The blue shampoo is blue shampoo, blue conditioner is blue conditioner, hair mask is hair mask, yada yada yada. If you want to know what I use in particular, please write in the comments and I'll let you know anything that you want. How do I employ this? I wash my hair twice a week, sometimes only once, only because my hair doesn't get dirty quickly and also because I want to protect my hair from the styling tools that I use, which are usually the hair dryer, the uh, curling iron and the straightener. On one wash, what I'm going to do is I'm going to wet my hair under the sink, I'm just gonna wet it, towel dry it, and I'm going to apply Olaplex number three. You can buy this in salons. Apply it, I'm saturated, follow the instructions. That's another video. <laughs> uh, apply it, saturate it, put my shower cap, that's why it's here, put my shower cap and just go about my day. Uh, even if you're cleaning the house, that wouldn't be a bad idea because the heat, okay, actually helps in the penetration of the product. Getting in the shower to get rid of my Olaplex, I'm going to use a regular shampoo, which I don't have here with me. I'll take anything, whatever my husband is using, my son, doesn't matter. And once I've done that, I'm going to use my blue conditioner. I put it on, five minutes, rinse it out, and I'm out of the shower. Once I'm out of the shower, I'm going to put this styling cream only at the end of uh, my hair. I don't want it to put it here because it's very greasy. Once I've done that, I'm going to put my, what's it called this thing? The uh, heat protective primer all over, and I'm going to comb through with a white tooth comb. Once this is done, I'm going to proceed to blow dry my hair, style it, do whatever I like. Once it's all finished, I am going to use the anti-frizz cream at the tips and then all over my hair, a couple drops of this uh, oil leave-in concentrated, so on and so forth. The second wash, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in the shower. This time I'm going to use the blue shampoo and I'm, when I'm finished, I, I get out of the shower, I, I towel dry my hair, I'm going to apply my mask, and then I'm going to tie it up, put it in, um, in, a, in a shower cap, and leave it on for as long as I can. Half an hour, if the minimum, in my opinion, but if you can have it for five hours, even better. Once the time has passed, put my head in the sink, rinse everything off, my hair is super, super soft, and I, even though it's soft, I still proceed with the styling cream at the tip, heat protective all over, comb it out once it's over, anti-freeze at the tips, and the oil, what's this called? Oil infuser leave-in concentrate uh, all over my head to give it that shine. The reason why I use all these products, it's because I like long hair. It's something that's pleasing to me and I'm not willing to give it up yet. And because of that, I have to use these products so that I can keep this as healthy looking as possible for the longest possible. Because who knows, maybe it's, it's not gonna work for me and I have to chop it all out. But until I don't, I'm using these products. If everything goes as planned, okay, in about a year and a half or so, year and a half too, when all my white hair have, will have reached here, 
more hopefully then obviously i'm not going to use all these products because that will be a overkill my hair will be oversaturated with oils and it's not going to look pretty at that time i'm just going to stick to blue shampoo blue conditioner I'm still gonna use all my styling products because I like to use the hair dryer and curling iron and the and the flat iron because I'm that kind of a girl. Changing subject, let's move on to something related to having white hair but not hair or anything. It's le maquillage and le vêtement. Yes, because of this color of hair, I cannot wear just any other makeup like I used to. Like before, I could put whatever colors, doesn't matter, black, white, brown, reds, and it worked. Now it doesn't work so much. I've noticed that personally, my eyebrows have to be much lighter. My eyeshadow, I like best when my eyeshadow is very dark and my lips are lighter rather than the other way around, even though I do love a red lip. Uh, if you follow me on Instagram, you will notice that. Um, but nonetheless, I find that the dark with the pale, it's much more rocky, more moi. Clothes, whereas before I could wear any kind of color, any kind of print, etc. I can't anymore. I find that what suits me best is solid colors, dark colors. It has to be worn in a certain edgy kind of way. It cannot just be prim and proper because wearing prim and proper clothes now with this hair, I really, really look like a grandmother, especially when I do this. Well, that's something else to consider uh, if you decide to go gray. Never thought I was going to have to deal with this. I thought I would just keep on going. But finally, no, I have some tops that I really, really love. And I had to uh, give them away because unfortunately it didn't work with me anymore. But again, I just find that my life is only going to get but simpler. You know, hey, if you have to choose print, no print, you know it's no print done so there you have it my dear friends this is my transition from dark dyed brown hair dark brown dyed hair dark brown dyed hair dark brown dyed hair that's it this is my transition from uh, dyed hair to white hair i'm at my six month goal target whatever that is that you know this this what this thing and um so that's it. I am not going to go back. No way, Jose. This is so liberating. I enjoy it so much. On a personal note, I find that it's so much more rockish. And I'm very happy. For me, it's the best. Some people don't like it. Meh. Like I always say, pay my rent and I will listen to you. Until then, mwah. thank you for watching. I hope to see you soon. Don't forget to press like and subscribe. Bye.